Mark Giesman is a part of the college preparatory program here at Regis Jesuit High School. He helps students to get through the college process as quickly and as stress-free as possible. Um, typically, you know, the first thing colleges are going to look for are, is the curriculum, which, you know, most Regis students are going to have that going for them, a strong curriculum, just because we kind of require all students to take, you know, a rigorous college preparatory um, curriculum. So what classes have you taken? How well did you do in those classes? You know, that's going to be number two. Number three, then, is probably going to be the dreaded test scores, ACT and SAT. Those are important, but not the most important thing. And then beyond that, there's a host of other things, including, like, you know, recommendations, extracurricular involvement. Where I see kids struggle the most is just with their essays, not being confident about that process. One tip would be just don't procrastinate. It, it, it can be... It can be stressful, but I think the most stressful part is just when you put it off to the last minute. If you plan accordingly, um, if you start in August, the earliest deadline is not until November 1st, so that gives you three months to get everything done, and that's plenty of time. It just becomes a problematic when you're starting you know, in late October or, or later. Um, but colleges accept applications all the way th until January, so the f students shouldn't feel the pressure that I think many of them do feel. Chet Dunstan is a senior at Regis Jesuit High School who is being recruited to play lacrosse at the Air Force Academy. He has high hopes for what is to come. Yeah, it's really exciting to get recruited from the uh, Air Force Academy to play lacrosse. Um, my biggest fear is probably the whole military aspect. Um, I've always wanted to study uh, something in the lines of like engineering or something because I'm really smart. I've always had a, like, above a 3.8 GPA at Regis. Josh is another student who is currently planning his college future and is working with the college preparatory program with people like Mr. Giesman. Well, I sort of like the Cali Swag District, so I'm probably going to go to California. Um, I don't know. I might go where my dad went to school, Santa Clara, but I'm not really sure yet. Maybe Miami of Ohio. I'm excited to go to college because I want to meet new people. At, in high school, I've really only been around the same people. Most of them are just like your average white person, but at college they're culturally diverse. So I'm looking forward to that. I'm also looking forward to taking different classes. Josh is excited to see the connection of where his high school career ends and his college career begins. Giesman and future college students have high hopes for the future of the school and this program. I'm super excited with the new College Counseling Center. I feel like this year we're able to give more individualized service than what the counselors were able to do before when they were dealing with college counseling in addition to um, personal and academic counseling. So I really feel like we're off to a good start.